I want pandas. No matter what, I want pandas. Hello, Mother Mage here, and welcome to a game called Pixark. I don't know, well, yeah, let's go for a single player world right now. For now, I have a. Ooh, I have two characters. I have this one, which I just created. I literally just spawned in with this one, so. And then load the world. Loading could take a while, but it shouldn't take too long, because this game is not as bad as uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance. Though with my recording software, it is pushing my CPU up to 96%. So figured it would be nice to just like update you guys on how my CPU is doing while I'm recording something. So it's a bit of an interesting mechanic. But in any case, we're loading. Ooh, no music. That means it's done loading. I did try and set down the music, but the main menu doesn't want to set down the music, so I don't have to cut out much because I loaded up quite fast. CPU is a bit struggling with the uh, loading of the world, rendering it up, because I did sort of set the graphics up to max, and it's running smoothly once it's loaded, so it's going to take a bit, and then it should work. And as you can see, I already created a character. I figured female because um wait, let me let me go die and then recreate a character. Just so that you guys can see the creation. Come on. Just so little damage. Oh, that that voice though. There we go. Sorry about killing myself. Don't follow my example. I will be recreating a character. It will be female because everybody, every other YouTuber that I've watched has created a male character, so I decided, meh, go a bit differently. Go for this hairstyle. Let's basically just recreate that character. Let's see here, black hair. Yeah, let's go for red hair. Burnt red hair. Sort of like just like a dark, dark red. Yes. Yes, I do watch Partially Royal. I do watch quite a lot of YouTubers. Because they're quite good. I like, quite like Partially Royal's videos. I've also watched Zuljin's videos of them about this. Because they were really cool. That's actually how I came to notice this game. Set this to slightly red, just like red tinge. Just so it looks a bit more natural because your your hair actually does keep a little bit of their uh, color. So beard and eyebrows actually keep a little bit of the original color, but oh that's a that's a three mouth. You know something's wrong with you when you have a three mouth. See here, let's go for a... Yes, that. Now, I don't want any of these. Uh, besides, maybe a uh, pirate eye patch? Nah, because I'm going to go for mainly magic, but I'm going to be doing both. See here, any... Ooh, let's go over there. Far away from any positions I know. Uh, it would appear that my microphone is bugging out again. So I'm going to quickly do a cut here and fix it. Okay, it's fixed. Uh, reason why it broke and started generating static is because it fell earlier. Just onto my lap, but uh, still, it's a bit. It, does, it doesn't do good with falling onto my lap. Ooh. Red Beacon is way over there in the southwest. More like west southwest, but hey. Now, let's zoom in. 
Start punching trees! I did play up until like level 11, 12 ish last night just so I can get the hang of the game. Just so that I don't, you know, slow, slow down and try and learn things and stuff like that. Because I have not played Ark. I've heard that this is sort of like Ark. This is very much like Ark. Oh yeah, I'm. I feel really close to these blocks. I know that there was this, but uh, yes. Just apply a bit of a further view, a bit better of a field of view. Okay, so I've leveled up a couple of times. I don't know if I want to spend my ingrams just yet. Let's first pick up a few plants. Uh, let's craft some things. So I should be able to craft. Ooh, I don't have enough wood. Let's learn campfire. We always need campfire. Sleeping bag. Clothing, because clothing's quite nice. Or 12 left. Suppose I need to learn some thatch things. I really don't need a tutorial, but it's trying to force feed me a tutorial. I know most of the basics, but I don't need the basics, sadly. Now we do not have the XP rates set up on this map, so it is actually quite slow. If we've already reached level four, once you start, in my experience, once you reach level ten, it starts getting a bit slower, like really slow, noticeably slow, but not that slow. Now we will. Create some clothes because I uh, can't just keep running around without any on. Well, besides the basic grass. I don't want to constantly be running around with grass on. Okay, there we go. That looks a bit better. These, they're just going to run away. Pterodons or whatever they're called. Cannot remember their name. And they're called uh, pterodons, but I know Ark has a different name for them. So I'm just, or every YouTuber has a different name for them. So yeah, I still need to learn a bit more of uh, Ark Survival Evolved because I still wanted to play that game, but now I've got this game. So <gasps> there's a rabbit. Yes. Let's feed it. Be mine, rabbit. Be mine. By taming, I should also get a little bit of experience. That means that I won't have to be gathering as much or attempting to kill anything. Okay, so it seems that this spawn point is between a lot of the uh, the towers, obelisks. Um, I assume that they're like obelisks, because they look like an obelisk. Oh, uh, I just got scared. Is you I was taming? No, it was that one that ran away into the water of doom. Anything below here that wants to eat me? I'm very much afraid of water, because I'm not meant to be in water. Ah, but what are you doing? Oh, you, yeah. I'll, I appear to have lost the one I was taming, or I scared that one to the point where it decided not to tame. So, yes, there's that. That's a bit of a, a bummer. I was hoping to tame him, but thanks to my running around all the time, I, he got scared. Approach him slowly. Come on, look at me. Oh, look at... It doesn't want to look at me. Oh, he's so damn cute. Why is he so damn cute? Oh, yeah, I forgot... To, oh, yes, I forgot to change the name of this character. 
So we will henceforth be known as Jenny. Now, this is a rabbit, a big eared rabbit, and they're cute. There's only one thing that I like more than this, and that is the pandas, which I've seen. I know that there is pandas in this game, and I want some pandas. I want pandas. No matter what, I want pandas. Fill the entire base up, base up with pandas and I will be there. Probably. Now, I don't know what to name this guy. I guess I'll just call him... Big Ears. Big Ears. And now you can put him on your head. I like that. I like that you can actually put them on your head, that, that just gives it a nice touch. Now, engrams, let's see what we can learn. We can, we can learn a packy saddle, yes! We are out of engrams, so... There's that. Now, one thing I'm definitely looking forward to is the magic, because I want to get into this. This is where I want to be. I want to be in this magical area. Doing all the magic -y things. But that's still ways away because we're still going to need to level. But I see, uh, I, I was on a server earlier today. Where I was just like, uh, just checking what type of servers are, there are. And how, how good a connection I have to them. Uh, overseas uh, connections are not too wonderful. I did see there is some European servers that were... Okay, they're like 120, 130 ping. But the South African servers, which is where I live, have like 70. So I might start there. I did see that I have about like 200 to 300 ping to Royal server. So if I can sort of talk him into uh, allowing me on, maybe, maybe. But I don't personally know him, so he's probably not going to allow me to join. However sad that is. I would love to be able to join him. Oh. Wait, what? Oh, my stamina's out. That's what it was. Oh, that was stem berries. Good thing I ate the stem berries. Because that just boosted my stamina up like crazy. Not those, though. We're not eating narco berries. Not yet, anyways. Unless there is some reason we would want to knock ourselves out. It's the only time we're going to be eating narco berries. I did do my research, so yes. So that I wouldn't fall into uh, time like that. Please don't eat me, Fiomia. Now, these creatures have a habit of pushing people. They're like, you're a lower species, I can push you around. And they enjoy it. You can tell by their faces. Now what I can do is I could attempt to tame a Fiomia. But I'd rather want a, per, uh, a Paki. Because I can actually ride him. Once I have some leather. Which I still don't have because I haven't fought anything yet. I don't want to fight a Fiomia because uh, that's suicide at this point. Or a trike. A trike's also suicide. You. Dodo. I'm sorry. Sorry, Dodo. I mean, it didn't even leave me as leather. Just do it like this. Get it all sorted out. We can set up a campfire and try and cook meat. Ooh, there's a packy. I need this over here so I can feed this packy. I'm assuming you just feed it whatever you have. Packies aren't really fussy, I'm hoping. Yay, I got one leather. I need how much leather for this? Five. So I only need four more leather P 
pack. Yeah, let's call him Pack. Pack the Packy. Before he gets killed, let's just pack him up. He is a pack, so it's fine. He's meant to be packaged. What is that? That's a terror bird. Why does that seem dangerous? Well, by by the looks of it, it's very dangerous. It's on par with the pterodon. Or a pterodactyl. Or one of those two. I'm not sure which one is which. Can I destroy this? Did it hurt me? No! What? I can stand inside a cactus. Good to know. Assuming that that is something that will be added in the future. Because cactuses are not supposed to allow you in like that. Cactuses are unfriendly. Can I mine this? Let's see. Stone pick. Ehydrated. Ooh. Forgot that there was hydration in this game. Water. And, uh... Deserts sort of dehydrate you, surprisingly enough. Who would have expected that? Now, I do have a packy, but I need to kill more things. Pterodon is not going to die. I might be able to do something about killing a Fiomia. If I actually prepare correctly. And then find a nice low level. So we also need to level up. Oh, I might be able to get a spear now as well. Forgot about this. Now, DIY hut. Scrap that. Let's just learn it for now. Metallurgy only unlock at level 20. Never been level 20, so. It's kind of fun. Good to do new things. Now, what I wanted to do is get a bunch of dirt. We're going to need quite a bit of dirt. I might be able to kill a uh, pterodon like this as well. Pterodactyl. Oh, come on. Stand still for a little bit. Gonna try and block him in with a too high wall. Okay, now mine out that one. It's not the prettiest wall I've built. Granted. Let's just quickly mine away all of this. So actually these will help me to build it in. Because I want to box in a Fiomia in here. I need to anger a Fiomia without dying. Fiomias aren't the slowest creatures. So we're going to have to hit and run. Some of you can't get on here. You can attack me while I'm on here. Okay, well let's see what we require for a... Spear. I need one rock. Oh, I just thought this one was, uh, they, they were gonna tag team me here. Ah! Run! It's angry! They are not friendly! They are not friendly once they're hit! Still has not given up on me. Oh, no! I fell off. 
It's as good a time as any to explain what happens when you fall off. You don't drop anything on your hotbar, but you do drop everything on your... Ooh, where am I? Okay, there. There's my stuff. If only I had the balloons and I dropped a bit closer to there, but hey. Triceratops. Oh. I was running too fast, and then uh, of course I would fall off. There's going to be so many of my graves down there. Come on, Pterodon, take, pick me up. Well, I'm level 7, so that's 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 quite nice. Let's quickly level up some of my stuff, like stamina. So we're going to need a bit of stamina. Weight capacity. Everyone knows weight capacity is important. Now, another thing I've heard is... Uh, Oh, is that Triceratops drowning itself? Seriously? Again I fall off? I'm nearing death. At least my rabbit is still alive. That will m keep me going. Why is this... What is with this ominous scary noise? Oh. Um... Problem. <laughs> I picked up the Triceratops egg. That was a bad idea. I I I was thinking like, oh, it's stuck drowning at the top, so it wouldn't attack me, would it? Well, it will. It'll in fact run down to get me. Oh. Sorry about this. I'm probably going to cut this out. <laughs> because, um, yeah, I'm doing horrible. And I'm really far away. Well, not super far away, but still, like, you know what I mean. Not close by. All this for a Fiumia. You still take full damage even though you're inside a water stream. Oh, no, it was probably that that hurt me. Now, I need to be quick because once I pick up this item, I think it's probably gonna chase. No, no, no. Ah, yes, it is going to chase me. I knew it was gonna try and chase me. I should probably pick up everything except for the egg. Luckily now I spawned right close by. Okay now, I need to transfer everything manually except for the egg. So that they won't just constantly be killing me. I don't need that. So you can swim upwards. This is good. This is the easy way out. I like the similarities between this and Minecraft. What's it meant? Minecraft? I've played Minecraft at a friend's house, but... Minecraft was really fun. Even modded Minecraft was really fun. But... This is quite fun. It feels like a modern Minecraft. Feels like I just picked up Minecraft for cheap and then... Yes. Like a bit more cost-effective version of Minecraft, I would say. By cost-effective, I literally mean it's, it's a bit more economical. It's a bit more cheaper. A bit more to my budget. Now don't go mining anywhere near that Fiomia, because he will kill me. And I also need to mine down for stone. So if it's going to get a bit dark, I don't 
I haven't found a uh, bug around here anywhere. No torch bugs. Gonna need one stone. That's so that I can craft myself a spear, because a spear is a way better killing tool than that. Okay, now that I have a good damage item. And I have almost blocked up the Omia. I have to make sure it's very blocked up. I also probably get myself high enough to just barely reach it when I'm crawling. I can't touch it. Okay, so... It can attack me, but I can't attack it. Ah, there we go. Much better. Now this is the way you do it. You can't do nothing to me, and I can just attack it all day. There we go. Still didn't level up, but that's at least better than nothing. Give me that leather. There we go. Got the leather, so let's spawn you in. Okay, open up my inventory and craft a packy saddle. For pack. Pack, you will be my mount. Ride. Oh, now this is cool. First time actually fully taming a mount and actually being able to ride it. So it is very special for me. Now I'm not going to be fighting any Fiomias just yet. We're going to be killing Dodos though. Dodos are like free food. Now should probably head over the river and see what's on the other side. I like that the eyes are glow in the dark. So I can actually still see the eyes during the night. Ooh. Look at these eyes. Oh. Look quite nice. Damn, all these unique eyes are so beautiful. Some of them are comical like this. Like, look at that. Like Oh. See if I can charge across water. No. What is that? Kisaurus. I believe that they're friendly. Relatively. Up to a certain point. Don't know. It's, it's actually been quite... It's, it's, I've actually reached this point quite quickly. Now you... You will get killed. How's my uh, Packy's health looking? Packy's health is still fine. Damn. So the way you need you need to survive this quite easily is by taming. Taming is an easy way of surviving this. Sometime this week I will be swapping over to a server. Ooh, there's a quest. Quest terminal way up there. It also looks like a frosted biome. I'm just trying to avoid magic biomes. And that, I believe, is another thing I want to avoid. That is a raptor. Oh no, we are not going over there. Even though we want those quests, we are not going over there because they've got raptors. And I cannot handle raptors. They always seem to kill me. No matter what game I'm playing, if there's a raptor in it, a raptor will kill me. 
It's one of those definite things I will die to a raptor at one point. Ooh, is that a... What is that? Dragonfly. Passive. No gender. Wild. Swamp outer ring. Normal creature. Well, it's passive, so that's nice. It's not going to attack me. I was expecting it to be some sort of bee creature that's just going going to want nothing but to kill me. But hey. I like this one more. It's friendly. So is this then the edge of the map? That is the question. I've always wondered what the edge of the map looks like this. And it looks like just a solid wall. Kill some dodos and see if we can't level up Packy. Still quite a distance away from leveling. But I've reached a higher level, so I'm happy. To increase weight and health, because health is important. We can learn doors. Magic carpet. Luxury, uh, this luxury carpet can be used to decorate your house. So these are just fancy carpets. I'm sad that I learned that because that's basically just decorations and I do not have the use for decorations just yet. Wood table, wooden spike wall, wooden spikes. And I'm currently level 9 so... Almost halfway to level 20. What level is this pack here, though? I believe he is level 8, if I look at the left side there. Should be able to kill this one. Hoping. Yes, he killed it. Beautiful. I do know how to feed them. That's at least one good thing. Just check it in there. It's a little bit of an inventory. It doesn't show it's an inventory, but it is there, so... You kind of need to know it's there, otherwise you're not going to know it's there. Dodo! Get eaten. So that should be enough for now. Let's try and get to the mainland because uh get the feeling there's only so much I can do here. Otherwise we could head north or south rather. Oh, almost fell down. That would not have been fun. Triceratops eggs, where's the triceratops? There. No, we're not grabbing this Triceratops egg and running. But we need to level. This is the one thing. You must level. And rabbits don't give enough levels. So we gotta tame something bigger. A better packy. If we can tame a better, a bigger packy then we can actually go and destroy some of these guys because currently this one is but only a level 8 that is kinda not not the strong packy but ooh I do not want to jump There's a scorpion. Um, uh, how about we check out what that scorpion is? Is it? Oh, it is. It is definitely aggressive. I'd like to just be able to like lock on. It's level two. Normal creature, desert center. 
How about we could try and fight it with our level 8? We could try and tame one of these fishes and then try and ride them back to the main island, but this is actually a pretty cool place. You're level 2! Should still be able to kill him. Oh! He does a lot of damage! Okay, no! Stab it! I do believe I'm not doing much damage to it. Okay, I cannot deal any damage to it manually. That is worrisome. What other spawn points do we have? Because I don't feel like spawning there anymore. Because that place seems uh, like a bit of a dead end. There's enough sp room to expand and do things. It's a good defense. Defendable position, but the problem is there's not enough that I can, that is low level that I can kill. This place seems a bit more open, I could say so. Do keep my uh, clothing, so that's at least good. What's this glow? Ooh, yes! Come on. There we go. Let's just name him nothing for now. Ready you go. Ah, there you are. I can pick him up, and he's on our shoulder, so now we've got a light. Now I can kill some things. Ooh, and we found a quest. Quest machine. What is your quest, though? Crafting quest. Stone pickaxe will help you dig more easily. So I need to craft a stone pickaxe. I do not have the engrams for a stone pickaxe yet. That is on level 10, so I need to level up one more time, which is not that far away. As you can see, not that far away. Now, stone pick, stone axe, mortar and pestle, cooking pot. Let's learn a lot of things. Guiding post, I don't need that just yet. Sling, however. That could be good, because that's a uh, early game ranged. I'm going to need a water bag. For now that should do. Now what do I need for... I, I pretty much need everything because I lost everything. Forgot about that. It's an entirely different spot. I've already reached level 10. I'm happy. Let's get a bunch of, like, uh, wood. Should about do it. Now we're going to need some stone. Try and get to a... Stone pickaxe as soon as I can. It's not going to be calling a stone because it's stone. It says it's rock, but it's stone. It comes out of the ground. It's hard. It's probably stone. So, yes. Okay, so now I should be able to craft a pickaxe, June pickaxe. Drop that one, craft a stone, a hatchet. Drop the old one. Craft a sling. Let's get some more stone without however could use more stone. I always use some stone. Stone is always nice to have. And I'm assuming rockets will also, you know, if you build a base out of stone, rockets will do less flash damage and stuff like that. So, that'll be interesting. Now, this dodo is a really high level, but dodos at least just run away, so. That helps. 
so it will still get a massive amount of uh, experience for killing it. So I can't pick up you while using while wielding a. You stay away from me. It's a coyote, but still, it's it's. Even coyotes can kill someone. That doesn't that is not something I would like to experience. Need ten rock for that. Probably also going to need a place to like a little bit of a base. Ooh. What are those again? Uh Parasaur. Beautiful. Now we're going to need some flint. If we're gonna be using the uh sling for things, we're gonna need some flint in order to protect ourselves. Because without flint, we are a bit unguarded. The more flint we get, the more ammo we have. Please don't eat me. Parasaur. I know parasaurs are herbivores, but still. Oh yeah, I can go pick up that reward. I forgot about that. I forgot that it was for pickaxe. Stone pickaxe. What are you going to give me? 